Greetings and welcome to a new video. I hope you are all doing well. So the primary focus of this video is on importing and installing or applying themes using Kaubanga Lite Windows GUI because I already made a complete full guide on how to use Kaubanga Lite Windows GUI version. That guide is in the description in the pinned comment and in the card above. The method shown in this video is completely free. So a brief introduction is that you can use this Kaubanga Lite Windows GUI version to tweak or theme your device. You can use it on any device on any version starting from iOS 15. So it will work on iOS 15, iOS 16, iOS 17. So first of all, get to its official and GitHub page. Again, it is completely free. And here you will see releases and also it is completely open source as you can see it right here. Scroll down and please get the zip file from here. Also for this to work, the only requirement is iTunes. So get iTunes directly from the Apple's website. You can get it from the official website right here for your Windows PC. Now simply extract the zip file that you have got. Now please connect your device via USB and then open Kaubanga Lite. You will see this file. So guys, the software looks like this and you can see it works without a jailbreak. A jailbreak is not required. So as you can see, I have this iPhone on iOS 16.7. Now guys, as I have shown you in my previous full guide, you can see that you can also use the explore tab to get the themes that are built into Kaubanga Lite Windows GUI as you can see it right here and then simply download them from here. Now this video focuses on importing themes from somewhere and then applying it to your device via Kaubanga Lite Windows GUI. So you will go to icon theming, hit modify and then from here you can import your themes via a zip file or a folder. Now let's first of all get a theme. You can simply go to havac.app. It is the official website for the Havac repo. You can get completely free themes from here. Now you can simply hit themes and from the slider, you can simply slide it all the way to free so that it will only show the themes that are completely free. Of course, guys, you can get the paid ones if you like. But in this video, I will focus on all the free ones. Now, for example, I get this Miso theme. Hit on get and then hit add to account. Now from here, please enter your email ID so that you can log in. Enter it here and then continue with email. You will get a link to your email and then you can use that link to log in to havac.app. All right, guys, now you can use that link to sign in to Havac. Now, guys, once again, add to account. All right, and you can see it is completely free as you can see it right here in summary. Scroll down and then hit download icons. You will get a zip file. Now, please extract the zip file that you got. All right, so now we are good to go. Now guys, get back to Kaubanga Lite Windows GUI and then go to icon theming and then simply enable modify. Now, as told earlier, you have two options. You can import it via folder or a zip file. The zip option did not work out for me. As you can see, if I select zip and open, I see zero icons. So I will delete it. So for this, we will go with the folder approach that we have extracted in previous step. Open it and then get to the folder. Open it, open it again, open it again until you reach the root of the folder. All right, then select folder. You can see we have got the icons. We have 620 icons in this theme. We will simply hit apply and then add to device from here. Then go to setup options and hit modify and make sure skip setup is enabled. Then hit apply and then hit apply changes. 
you will see restore in progress and you will see this message and your device will reboot now guys after your device boots up you will see restore completed now simply hit continue and it will take you to the home screen straight away now guys you can see the theme icons are now applied as you can see it right here now you will simply have to remove or add the unthemed icons to a folder so i will quickly do it all right guys so after getting all the unthemed icons to folders i am only left with the themed icons as you can see it right here and yes they open up all the apps just fine without any problem as you can see it right here so yes it looks beautiful and it all works without a jailbreak as you can see it right here that's all for this video if you have any question feel free to ask in the comment section and i will see you in a new video goodbye and take care